This is new at six. They call them kindness blankets. And for an Abington family, they are helping turn tragedy into triumph. They say it's a simple idea, a gesture to let people know you care. When three sisters lost their mom to suicide, that idea became part of their healing. WBZ's Anna Ritas Rodriguez has the story. She was just so nice. She was like, honestly, one of the best moms ever. And it's a shame that, you know, she's not here because she should be here still. Ann Varney was just 36 when she took her own life two years ago, leaving her husband and three daughters. My first year after my mom passed away, I was very lost. So Angela, Christina, and Mia Varney, with the help of their aunt Barbara, decided to honor the way their mom helped others. This is a kindness campaign, you know, definitely like giving back, paying it forward. They created Annie's Kindness Blankets, homemade fleece blankets they give away to people who might need a hug of sorts. The best part is they're like comfy, like when you like wrap them around, it feels like you're filled with kindness. They started at the kitchen table and gave their blankets to kids in the hospital. Then something extraordinary happened. Other people joined the effort, creating blanket making events, and the kindness spread. They've given out nearly a thousand blankets to children, homeless people, people battling depression or dealing with tough times. They feel the kindness all around them. I mean, strangers are sending these to strangers to help them understand they're never alone. It's all in Annie's name. I think she would have wanted this. I think she's really happy, like right now, with what we're doing. Once we started making the blankets and I saw people smiling and stuff in honor of her, it's made me and the rest of my family heal. It's spread with happiness and, like, love. The family started making kindness blankets a year and a half ago. A GoFundMe page has been set up to raise money to buy the materials they need. If you'd like to help, go to our website, cbsboston.com, and we'll connect you. David? Yeah, Great story. Thank wow. you so much. And you can just imagine somebody out there who's down on their luck. They get the blanket, they hear the story, and could possibly be saving lives. Right. I mean, just to know that these three young women who have yeah. been through so much really do care. That's great. Let's